who may have the freshest tires in the field on the racetrack right now. First attempt at a green-white checker finish from Homestead Miami Speedway in the 2012 season. Green flag back in the air. Kyle Busch with a great restart once again. And you talked about Pluto. He's looking to the inside. Look at Johnny Sutter going up the middle, trying to get between Joy Carter and Carol Gale. Four wide as they come out of turn number two. Timothy Peters doing whatever he can to try to get a glimmer of hope for this championship as you see the three on the apron way down against the inside wall. Will Kyle Busch get to Victor Lane for the first time in 2012 in his truck? This time by, the white flag will fly one more time around in the 2012 season. Look at the run that Cale Gale got off turn four. He drove right up on the tailgate of Kyle Busch. Cale Gale looks to the inside. Kyle Busch right in the middle of the racetrack. Coming out of two. Cale Gale goes to the inside. No contact made. Cale Gale has the advantage down the back stretch. Now here comes Kyle Busch once again. Into turn three. Kyle Busch right in the middle. Cale Gale, the inside. As they come out of turn number four. Cale Gale with the advantage. Does the momentum carry Kyle Busch back to the start finish line? They hit. They come across. Cale Gale wins. Gale will win at Homestead. Woo! How about that? What a great job for Cale Gale. Cale Gale rubbing against Kyle Busch as they came out and took it out. You got it. Cale Gale wins the last race of the year. Holy cow. There you go, bro. He might have had pressure tires, too. He pitted on lap 126, 21 laps after Kyle Busch pitted. Look at the left front tire already flat on Cale Gale's truck. He was squeezing Kyle into the wall to slow that momentum. And it's official. Your 2012 NASCAR Camping World Truck Series champion, is James Busher. Congratulations to that whole 31 team. Congratulations to them. Congratulations to Gail Gale. What a great job winning this race. Eddie Sharp Racing gets both his trucks to victory lane. Justin Lawton at Charlotte and Gail Gale here at Homestead. How about a ninth first time winner? Ninth first time winner. Incredible. 16th different winner in 22 on the 2012 races. season in 22 races. That's incredible. And who did he have to pass to get that win? Just Kyle Busch. Probably one of the best ever in the Camping World Truck Series on mile and a half tracks, Kyle Busch. And he did it. He did it. He roughed him up a little bit. Yeah, he, he had, did it. He had to squeeze <laughs> him a little bit to grab that win. And he's going to enjoy this win. The celebration for the 31 team of James Busher as well as the 33 team of Cam Gale. That is a championship burnout. It's a, it's a heck of a day at sea, sir. There's more stuff going on. Fireworks off the back stretch. Fireworks off turn four. Let's look one more time. Here he goes. Gale had to run on the bottom. Didn't quite clear Kyle. Watch him squeeze him up, though. It's the only thing he could do. It's the only thing he could do. Yeah, you know, and Kyle came down to, to side draft Kale, too, and got over on the side of Kale, and maybe Kale said, well, if you're going to come over, I'm going to join you. Unbelievable. Isn't that a great way to finish our 2012 truck season? Gail Gill is going to say yes. Kyle <laughs> yes, Busch is going to say no. James Bush is going to say yes. James Bush Todd is going to say, yes. say no. He's going to say no. The emotions of this sport, of NASCAR racing, that's passion there. That's desire. Look at the margin of victory here. It was 14 one thousandths of a second. About a foot. And there was smoke and sparks. That's how a race should end, right? First ever win. The Camping World Truck Series for Kale Gale. We talk about the emotional highs and lows. We go to Herman. Todd Dillingham.